I guess with that, we can jump right back into the uh, storyline here. So first thing, go to the Waking Sands in Vesper, uh, Vesper Bay. So luckily, I think I actually, or you know what? Um, are we nearby? Let's see. Adventurer's Guild. Uh, hmm. It's like somebody from the free, free company is saying uh, hello. Yo, what's going on, Veda? Merry Christmas, bro. Yo, Merry Christmas, man. I hope all is well. I hope uh, you have a very Merry Christmas and all that good stuff. I see that you're, uh, I saw you're playing some Battlefront. How's that going for you? Through uh, Discord, I saw you. Uh, okay, so. It's interesting. You could travel all the way there by yourself. Oh, it's actually in this area. But I'm trying to see if there's a, is there a ferry dock here somewhere? I feel like there is. Uh, Adventurer's Guild. Maybe if we go to the steps. Because if there is a ferry dock, then we could just take it straight there. But right this second, I do not see one. The goblet. There's steps again. Steps again. It doesn't look like I'm seeing one. All right, we might just have to... Uh, I uh, go to this point and then maybe maybe there's a um, chocobo person that we can hire that'll just take us over to there. I mean, it's not too far away, which is nice. Just did some offline campaign stuff, so nothing much old school Battlefront 2 though. Okay, nice. Thanks. I uh, really you're playing the the classic one. I haven't played that game in in uh so so long. That was one of like the first Steam games I ever bought too which is kind of funny um i still remember when that game was out on playstation 2 i remember my cousin he had it but i i never bought it or anything like that and i remember asking him to borrow it and i literally borrowed it for like three months but he didn't like he was kind of like growing older so he didn't really what the hell <laughs> Yo, Veda, my dude. Thank you so much for the five gifted. Holy crap, dude. For a while you gifted two. Wait, how many was that? Five? Two? Okay, two. Well, total of five, I see. Yo, thank you, dude. For real, thank you very much, man. To NK Mills and Death Star Dry. Yo, dude. Thank you for uh, gifting themselves, Beta. I always appreciate it, man. You don't have to do that. Really, really don't have to, man. But thank you for for stopping by and, and being here, man. I, I always appreciate having you. Always a pleasure. Thank you very much, man. Merry, 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 merry Christmas as well. <laughs> Why? Well, I, I really do appreciate it. For real. It means a lot to me. Uh, nice. So we can travel to Vesper Bay. But, uh, thank you, man. I don't know how, how I can say thank you enough, but for real, thank you. I appreciate it. Number one. <laughs> Taking the lead for them, them gifted subs. How was uh, the rest of your uh, your cooking stream? How'd that go for you? Or like the cooking simulator stream, technically. Oh yeah, I trimmed up. I, I said, I know, I, I kind of, what was that, yesterday? Um, yeah, it had to have been yesterday because I got my hair cut and then because I got my like good old, you know, like, aid which my buddy does 
and uh, and then afterwards I I trimmed up my beard a bit. So it, it, I mean, it feels a lot nicer. It feels thicker and everything. I took like um, my hair clipper things that I have and just trimmed up the sides and then brought it down here a bit as well. It's still like a little like I hate those little um, like you get the curls everywhere, you know? And like, no matter what I try, like I try brushing it, I try using beard oil. I didn't put anything in today, but like, I don't know. I, I wish all my stuff would just stay flat and like stay down. Looks neat, thank you though. <laughs> Did your trim today too? Nice, nice. Yeah, if it's shorted, it curls. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> too much to do at the same time, so I lost the grip out there. <laughs> I skip through this here. I've actually when my when I did my first character for this game, this is about the area that I got to. And I kind of just stopped. So we're starting to hit territory that I haven't been in or semi familiar with have this uh have the same thing after a after it reaches a certain length it shrinks itself okay nice that's the one thing i i do like about well plus it smells good using like beard oil and like that kind of stuff um when you do use it it can help but in my experience it hasn't always like so you're the adventurer of whom I've heard so much. Voice acting. It's a rare well occurrence met, in this friend. game. My name is Minphelia, and I lead the Scions of the Seventh Dawn. I have awaited your coming. I don't know why this thing doesn't Please, update. be at ease. You are among friends here. See if I can get this to uh, update here. No doubt you are ripe to burst with questions, but have patience. All will be revealed in time. First, let me begin by telling you who we are and what we do. We are the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, an order that transcends oh, political shit. boundaries. Our the single objective is, is the preservation of the future of Eorzea. Oh boy. Again, Among our geez. gravest concerns are the godlike beings known as the primals. Use them channel Their points if you is got a bane them, people. Upon Eorzea. Nay, the world at large, and we have striven to find a lasting solution to the threat they pose. Doesn't tell me how much it is. Our order is home to a number of individuals who, like you, possess a rare and special talent. This talent takes various forms but one holds particular interest for us. Tell me, oh, wow, have they you actually... ever experienced a sudden, inexplicable loss of consciousness? Have yep. you ever had the sensation of being pulled away from reality? Felt Looks as like though they you were hovering in space, a mind without a body? Streams. All these things are the manifestations of your talent. Yours is the power to transcend the boundaries of the soul. A power known as the Echo. The Echo allows you to pass through the, the walls echo. of a man's soul and hear the resonations of his past. You will be there in his memories and see things as he saw them. You may even interact with that which you see, though you cannot change the outcome of events. For another blessing, the Echo will enable you to know a man's mind even if you cannot comprehend his words. In short, the Echo is a truly extraordinary power, and this power is strong within you. It is only a shame that we cannot use it whensoever we choose. Oh. That's right. I too possess the Echo. With that established, let us return to the subject of the primals. So long as they exist, the realm cannot take so much as a single step towards true peace. Measures must be taken, 
Measures which transcend boundaries, be they of faction, race, language, or creed. And to do so, the Scions require the aid of those with our talent. Make no mistake, the Echo will be instrumental in dealing with the primal threat. Without oh, it, it we cannot hope to save the realm. I know not what it is you desire for yourself, nor what it was that first brought you to Eorzea. But I firmly believe that the power we possess was given to us for a purpose. Why else would the gods entrust man with a gift so extraordinary, if not to have him use it? And so I implore you, lend us your power. It's a long cutscene there. <laughs> and now it goes to regular speaking. This I'm gonna skip. Hiring a retainer. Retainers can be helpful NPCs who can be hired by players to carry out tests such as storing excess skill and gear or selling items. And then it has all those as well. Nice. I, uh, will you say, what was their question? We'll go with the, the wild rose bloom. That works. I take it you will help us. Wonderful. I knew you wouldn't let us down. Same. But come, I would introduce you to your friends in the order. Tell me, does the name Charlianne ring any bells? It used to be one of Eorzea's six city-states and was situated in the northwest of Aldenard. The Charlians were the keepers of wisdom both old and new. Their mastery over magic and ether was unsurpassed, and even the Garlians knew to fear them. Among their number, there were a noble few who devoted their lives to safeguarding the future of Eorzea. When the realm began its descent into chaos, and their countrymen fled for the motherland, they alone chose to remain here. These noble men and women were called the Archons. Those same brave souls stand before you now. The masked woman is Ida, and beside her is Popolimo. The two are charged with surveying the Twelves Wood. Hello there! <laughs> Welcome! Okay, my turn to introduce someone. That there is Thancred. He is our man here in Ulda, Jewel of the Desert. Ulda. Welcome to the team. If I may, the lovely maiden beside me is named Yastola. Limsa Lominsa has yes, the pleasure Stola. of being under her care. Greetings. Yeah, we've met. We've met a good amount of times, actually. I have been expecting you. Last but not least is Urianger, who presides over all Urianger. affairs within these halls. Pray seek huh. him out whenever you have questions. This is why I stick to just the the first letter Dawn of their names. May banish even the darkest night. So that's you. The other one is Y. This is M. The words of a dear friend. I am glad of our meeting. At the Battle of Cartano, our leader was taken from us. We sought out Minfilia and others with her talent, and together established okay, the Minfilia Scions is not too of bad, the Seventh I'm Dawn. Along with the Archons, those blessed with the Echo play a pivotal role in our endeavor to forge a brighter tomorrow for the realm. Oh, I should also introduce you to Tataru, our clerk. She ensures that everything runs smoothly. She ensures that everything runs smoothly. Please to make your acquaintance. In time, I hope you will come to think of us as family. But without further ado, 
I would assign you your first task. Ooh. Uriange, have the documents arrived from the students of Baldessian? Aye, my lady. They arrived but recently. We have received a request for aid from the Immortal Flames. Thancred, would you do the honors? Wait, does this speed them up to? It would be my pleasure. Some days ago, a crystal caravan registered to Amagina and Son's mineral concern was waylaid and divested of its cargo. But there is more. Within a bell of the but robbery, several is more. people were reported missing from the shanty town the outside the city. Shirt is on me. It's like a, At a glance, says it's an one XL, would assume the involvement of like bandits, kidnappers, and, it's like and coincidence. Insane. I know it's completely random, Such but it's crimes just are hardly me. uncommon, but and the immortal comfy. flames deal with their like so. almost every day. However, this time we have reason to believe that a primal is involved. Aye, the evidence left behind implicates the Amolja, who are known worshippers of Ifrit. If we then consider the objects that were taken, there is no room left for doubt. The crimes were committed Please. in the name of a primal. That you may better understand the nature of our struggle with the primals, I would have you play the leading role in this investigation. You have my thanks. If there is aught you wish to know, I recommend you speak with Thancred. He is well versed in the affairs of Ulda. Ever at your service, dear fellow. Sounds good. I just realized the shoes that I have on. <laughs> okay. Well, there we go. Speak with Thankherd. Oh, do we need to go all the way up here now? Where is that? Oh my god. Uh, okay. We are so b far behind on the, the main quest. It's crazy. I think this le like this quest level is 17. I'm 10 levels higher than it. Just by doing like your daily uh, roulettes and daily quests and um, just doing that, having rested XP and like other things. I I'm extremely far behind right now. Or at least it feels like I am. But then this quest I have right here is a level 25 one. Which now, by the time I get to this, I'll be uh, above it. So, the best route to get here. And it sucks we don't have our mount yet to even do that. Uh, crap, dude. Dude. A dude. Is there a, I wonder if there's a faster way to get over here. Eastern Thanalan. I really wish that you could use the chocobos and just get to each area without having to already have discovered it. But I guess, I mean, it makes sense. See if the fairy, if it does even, if they can take me anywhere else. I'm so Lamensa, nah. There. Press in fairy docks. Eastern. And I, I mean, like, I could just go here and then cross to here and then go up through there and then boom, bing, bang, boom. Get there, but it's just a, uh, a, a journey for sure. Um. <laughs> and then you have somebody like this. Same. I wish I had him out like that. I guess that, that might be the route. I don't know of any other faster way. Unless if 
Wait, if I look at that one again, or is it right here? If I look at Eastern, yeah, I don't see, there's not any like specific way into it. So if Southern, nope, we don't have Southern unlocked. Central. Click on here about South Shard. Nope, we don't have that unlocked. I uh, Southern. Nope. Central. Nope. All right. Yep. That's the way. That's the route we're going. So best thing at this point is. I mean, I see either one of these works because either way, we're going to have to cross that thing. So I guess we'll go to Ulda and then from there, go up here, head up this way. And you know what? Actually, no, let's let's take this route because then it will take us straight there instead of going up here and then potentially there. Yeah, I'm going to go to Horizon. Plus, it's well, it's not cheaper, but shoot, I keep pressing escape to exit out this. There we go. still haven't even damn dude sucks we're so much higher than the uh the thing but we can't do it because uh so much higher than the main story quest but we don't have a mount because i haven't gotten to the grand company joining part selecting one i'm thinking about going uh twin adders for a grand company but then uh I feel like going Maelstrom could also be good. I'm not sure. But I think I think Twin Adders might be the, the route. We're just gonna run past here. It's a, a bit of a, a travel at this point. So we're gonna go up to Central, and then from Central we'll be heading to Eastern area. So hang a left here. Keep using them sprints as soon as we can. I need to keep remembering to uh, pop the food things when I can. So this is the first time me getting inside Central uh, Antalanalan. And I'll we'll head up to the Black Brush station, attune to that, and then keep going to Eastern there it's not the worst thing in the world i guess these enemies are level seven cool q and Three, two, one. Damn. You know what? I actually remember this place. Cause I was, yeah, this is about the area where I, I originally like started. Uh, when I was in my uh, playing my, Alma Church, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I remember getting here and, and traveling to the similar area and doing like quests around here as well. I don't know what it is, but I feel a little bit more invested this time around into the game, though. 
more like interested so looking forward to uh seeing where we go how far we get and hopefully i i do want to try to get through actually like the story content for the expansions and things too since i haven't done any of them at all um i know the the newest one is like 15 bucks right now so i might actually end up picking it up as well before the sale is over on steam I saw on uh, Square Enix's website that it was like, uh, I was like 30 the other day and I was like, oh damn, it's so much cheaper. And then the Steam uh, winter sale hit and then all of a sudden it was uh, 15 for people that have the collector's or complete collection, I think it is. And then it's, uh, how much for it's like 20 by itself which isn't bad it's still 50 50 percent off compared to its 40. and actually this the traveling right now isn't taking as long as i thought it was so so i might actually end All right, and we just need to get to Camp Drybone now, and we're almost there. I don't know why I do this, where I open up the map, and then I close it, and then I open up the map, and then I close it. Just like a habit in games to make sure I'm on the right track. Because I feel like when I'm not doing that, <laughs> then I'm going the wrong way. Nice. There's that. I think I actually remember this camp as well. Yeah, this area. What is this? The party finder? All right, has been added to party selection on the main menu. The, the party finder, you can either search for a party to join or recruit other adventurers to form your own party. Join a party, select search for party, and specify your search criteria upon. And then join party. Uh, to recruit adventurers for your own party, select recruit members and specify recruiting material. Okay, that's pretty cool. Trials, raids, and end game PvP, quest battles, fates, treasure hunt to the. Ah. People are using these as like selling things. Recruit members. Okay, that's cool. Best battles, fates. I'm just curious. I'm just checking this out for a second here. Nice. Uh, nothing's really better than what I currently have. I'm not going to bother doing any of the uh, levies or whatever they're called here because right now I'm still extremely over leveled for majority of this stuff and we're probably going to be continuing to level through it. So right now we are all set on that. Um, where's the chocobo person? Right here.
to... Why can you be so cold? Oh, there they are. Probably don't need to grab it, because we have uh, the point anyways, but that's fine. Unsolved mystery. So, where is this quest at? Upper Lanoska. Okay. Does it tell us what our reward is for completing it? We get some good stuff. Get some decent things, actually. Right, corpse. Um. Hostile presence. Oh no, they're level 12. Jeez. Retrieve the corpse. How, where are we putting all these corpses at? But I would like to know. Alright, let's keep going. Head back. people think uh, it looks like it's up and out so yep up here deliver the ah oh, shoot no it's down below Inside here. Yep. Speak with the common folk. Devious derelict. Petrified pauper. Oh snap, we're at 75% for boosting the stream. If you got them channel points, use them up. It's almost there. And then the, uh, from my understanding, the stream gets boosted to 2,000, 2,800 times, which is, uh, interesting. I don't know where, but I think it pops up on, like, 2,800 people's things. That's it. Speak with Marquis outside Church of St. Adam Van Bandama. So let's go left here, I guess. Yeah, otherwise we'd be going into the cliff here.
But you know what? We probably could have gone around where the chocobo is. Shoot. Didn't think about that. That's okay. It's leading us right over there. If there is gathering in the body, I think that's that right there. You. Is this overall XP or? Yes, it is. It says plus 3% XP. It doesn't really say plus 3% battle XP. So, about to hit 27 by handing in this next one, most likely. Or even just fighting. Really, really close there. I've been making sure each time I log out that I do so um, right when valid target. Do I need to go up there? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Uh, each time I've been logging out, I've been making sure I do it right where a, uh, like you're inside a, one of the things. Is that? Strongholds. Embalmed corpse. Bury the embalmed corpse. Report back to Mark 8. Gosh. Side here. Back over here, you know. Ah, uh, nah, 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 nah. Much as I, uh, I mean, I could, but we're so close. I'd rather save that that one thing for whenever I do start needing to use my skill, to fast travel places. So that's okay. that so he just popped up right there and then left oh shoot i don't know why i picked that up speak with the person at the where are they at? all the way up there oh my god Is there a pathway? Yeah, it looks like there's a bridge. If I go to the right or something like that. And then up through here. That sprint. Oh, that would have taken me out right there. My hunting log here doesn't have like any of these. I know before, oh, that's the other thing that I kind of knocked out for a bit. Um, a lot of these I didn't have. Um, I think a majority of, yeah, some are shrouds. There are some Eastern ones, um, but I haven't really seen any yet. And then yeah, South Shroud, Upper La Nos Noskia, South Shroud. Western Thanalan. Right now we're in Eastern, so. There might be like one or two, but it's not very like consistent in one specific area, so. It's okay. Coco Bow.
thought it was coming after me for a second. Uh oh. It's gonna be something that spawns. So. That thing's powerful. Fester. back. Don't mind if I do. Uh. Of the 59 currently recruiting, all matches your search criteria. I haven't even like changed any search criteria. None, none. Merry Christmas, everyone. What? What if I just join this? I feel like it would be very like a oh, high. Not any better. Go. All right. Okay, yeah, level twenty-eight. I do think that I'm leveling uh, a little bit faster than I was beforehand. Like on my my first character. Hmm. Funny how even though like some of this gear is like 19, 16, the gear well technically the quest I'm doing is like what 17. So I guess that that kind of makes sense. Yeah, the one I'm doing now is 15. So we're catch we're catching up at least. I probably have a good amount of like other. Uh, like guild house and dungeons and things like that that I could do too but I figure we'll probably reach them eventually or I'm, I'm pretty much saving them for a point where I need to do that, them to keep me in on and pace with the uh, the main story so it's okay go Are they actually going to fight me? Or am I? I'm, I mean, I'm 10 levels higher. I notice that sometimes they don't. Search for a clue. Ah, uh, nothing right there. Or anything glowing. Like silent right here. Ah, there's something. Got it. <laughs> Don't mind me just running by. Oh, that guy attacks me, of course. Of course. Wait, if I talk to this person, will they stop? Do not. Where'd my pet go. Problem solved. I go back. All right. Now we'll 
run up top. I think. Wait, are they on this level? Oh, they might be inside here. What the? Yeah, here they are. <laughs> yeah, what's going on, educator? Thank you for the vibe bits. Clean that house while you tap open for you. Hope you and uh, you and everyone in the chat a Merry Christmas. Christmas Eve vibes. Yo, thank you very much, man. Uh, I hope you have a very Merry Christmas as well. And as always, thank you for stopping by. Always appreciate it. Speak with the locals while garbed in weathered shepherd's tunic and pair a uh, weather right here Whip. and pair of weathered shepherd slops. Is that pants? That might be pants. <laughs> oh. Okay. Interesting. It is kind of cool how like the game incorporates like things like that where they want you to talk to people or like um using emotes uh using equipment that kind of stuff it's kind of cool you don't really see that uh very often i feel like in in games like this i think this one's above me Possibly. Where are they at? Or maybe they're over here. I think their logo. Wait. Looks like they're right here. Is it you? No. They're up there. Aha, uh -huh, I see you. Go over to this one and then go up there. all the way out there and speak with them again oh my god okay keep it going There's a lot of uh, traveling today. <laughs> I guess in general, you have a lot of just going from one area to the next in this game. 
What kind of cutscene do we got? One of these. One of these. Ah, there's the uh, the man. What do you want? Be at ease, child. Take this leaflet. Okay, go all the way back here. Works for me, I guess. That was our first job for them. And then I should be able to take a chocobo from here over to the... S for Bay, yes, please. There we go. It's good use of uh, travel there. <laughs> Pretty cool. I remember doing quests right here. I don't know. I think we can equip our stuff back. Yeah, there we go. Thanks. What a, uh, a change of an outfit. <laughs> oh, you know what? I think I can... Uh, yeah, I forgot that these shoes... Even though I don't really like them that much and just die them Two o'clock. Two o'clock on Christmas Eve. Why it's useful to get those. So now I can just go there and then head up there. All right. Ooh. Life, materia, and everything. Is it this way? No, nope, to the right. How many more quests do we have until the brand company? FX, IV, quests, this maybe? <laughs> Oops, cactus. Main scenario. We are on life. Life underscore. Okay, so life material and everything, Lord of Inferno, hero in the making, and the company you keep. There you go. So about three more quests, and then we choose a company, and then, yeah, then it'll go from there. Is this quest forging the spirit? There. <laughs> I 
<laughs> back over there. Why don't they just have a soul stone or whatever these call it, aether stone over there? Oh my god. It's so much go here, hand this person in, now go back. <sighs> the chocobo keep, yes, higher one, best for bay, thank you. The other route that you could take too would be going back to Limsa Lomin Lim Limon Limsa Lominsa or Limsa Lominsa, whatever, however you say it, going back there and then taking the uh the bay back over to or taking the the boat over to Vesper Bay. But that rate I don't think it would be any faster than than this, so. Go here, go there, deliver this, deliver that. It's okay. Is there a way in? Yeah, there's not like a, yeah. Yes. Look at us go, just banging them out. Not too bad. Um, yeah, I guess it technically is faster to take the chocobo up there. So. What is that one called? Golden Bazaar. Details the flames anticipates that I'm a, a mal will offer fierce resistance and you'll urge to prepare, prepare accordingly when you're ready proceed to the invisible city and lie and wait at the designated location. Uh, ah, shoot, you know what? We should have, we should have jumped off back there. Whatever. Yeah, we should have jumped off, like, when we were right here. And just head off, held up there. These hostile? Yeah, they are. As long as we can get up there, we're good. Corpse. But I... 
the highest level you can be is 24 for this. There's so much going on right now. I honestly don't know who to attack. I think I need to attack this dude because it seems like they just keep spawning in. fail they just keep on coming ah behind you working for the Empire the entire time. Uh, what is it? The Bowl of Embers? 
trials join no place here at all uh wait there's a ferry dock right there I wonder what take what can take you there oh right here And could go knock this out. It's one thing that kind of like breaks the like I get it. You need a time trial like to do it, but it's kind of it breaks your uh, momentum. I wish you could do them like like they would just give you companions, and not uh, if you wanted to queue up for it you could, but. If not, you could just, you know, I use like companions and stuff like Star Wars old or yeah, Star Wars the Old Republic. Um, when you do a flashpoint like that's story based, um, you'll have your main companion with you, but then also it'll give you like a droid that'll essentially fight on your uh, at your side as well and they're kind of like a, an op version of a, a dps slash tank so they they do a good amount of damage instead of having to queue up for like the flashpoint and do the story with somebody else for the first time nice oh it's actually not too far not as far as I thought at least. And then I think before I even go anywhere, I might even just go over here to tune to that. Since we're already out here. Witness. Uh, before we do that, hold on one sec. But we're good to go now. It's up here. Oof. Oh my god, I completely forgot that I was queued up still. Peace. The good thing it didn't pop while I was uh, a step away. These guys are level 24, so they're actually around my level. Can't see it. Ah! I can't see them.
go around this way. Can you climb up? Oh, nice. Jump. Let me get up before we travel. Hey, perfect. <laughs> perfect timing. Was that one of the, the stones? The shards or whatever? Looks like it. One of the, uh, the infinity stone, stones is the soul stone.
that's good enough. Oh man, brought me all the way back here. I guess we'll go back to that another time. Oh wait, Chopo right here. we knock that out it's 12 minute wait times i mean luckily they're not too bad but it's sucks having to kind of pause in your story progress to to do them and i i feel bad too because we get matched with people that are probably just like grinding stuff and then there's me Who's like doing it for the first time trying to watch it? Oh, I didn't realize that moves the camera. timing yep we did everything blah 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 voice acting cutscene no nope no voice acting what what How is it? Yep, the hiccups. Okay. Hang it up. It's already gone for it.
Yeah, we need to put away that stuff. Where we go? Yeah, I know. That's fine. Uh, attend the service and all that. Wow, we need to go to each one individually. Okay. actually kind of remember this part. I lost my son to the calamity. Mm. The three seed seers are all together. Some say you couldn't take a step without stumbling over a body. Our forebears were once strangers in the Twelves Wood. Fearful of the Green Wrath. They hid themselves in the dark recesses of the earth. Yet they dreamed of basking in the dappled sunlight of the forest. Through great effort, they proved their worth to the elementals and were granted a place beneath the boughs. So it was that Gridania was born some five centuries ago. Working hand in hand, the Hur and the Elizan settlers sowed the seeds of our civilization, and soon they were joined by folk of all races. So nourished by the waters of unity, and blessed by the light of the matron, Gridania flourished into the great nation it is today. Do you see the Gridanian standard? There. Hanging behind the Elder Seed Seer. The entwined serpents represent the unity between Hur and Elizan. An elegant symbol, do you not agree? In accordance with the will of the Elementals, we have embraced a life of peace. Alas, our neighbors have not always sought the same for themselves, nor for us. Though we Gridanians have no love for war, we have still less for those who would threaten our way of life. Ever have we fought to protect the sanctity of the Twelveswood. When the Garlean Empire brought its War of Conquest to Eorzea, we rallied under the noble standard of the Twin Adder that we might push back the encroaching darkness. And it was we who prepared the ground for the reformation of the Eorzean Alliance, that all the peoples of this realm might stand united against the common threat. Five years ago, the Alliance met the armies of the Empire upon the fields of Cartano. It would prove the bloodiest battle in recent memory. Countless Gridanian lives were lost. As Supreme Command... Alas, their loss was not the only tragedy it's to be thought. Extremely befall. long. Hero in the making.
Where are we at? Uh, let's go to the Chamber of Rule. And their remembrance. Behold, tis the Sultana Nanamo herself, and Roban as well. <laughs> Hark you souls of flame, drawn to the bosom of the desert, where the fire burns brightest and shall rage forevermore. Hurrah! Rauban! Where since antiquity, under the sage and judicious rule of the Ul dynasty, we have wrought sand into gold. Where by the grace and glory of Naldar have our brave sons and daughters flourished and prospered. I speak of Uldar! There, at the Flame General's back flies the Grand Company's standard. Note the sigil. The golden scales of order balance the jewel of prosperity with the flame of might. Great and many are the gifts our nation has given the realm. In Eorzea's darkest hour, on the killing fields of Cartano, none spent more in blood and gold than we. Thus was the Seventh Imperial Legion laid low. So that's how it happened. How soon history forgets. Yet many left our gates never to return. Let us pray for our absent brothers and sisters, that they might know happiness in the great beyond, as Thor's honored guests. If the fates were fair, the price we paid that day would have bought us victory. Alas, they are not. And now, but five years into this seventh umbral era, the spirit of sacrifice which granted us our strength is all but dead. Look around you. What do you see? A people divided, downtrodden, and enthralled. Where are the merciful alms of the rich? Where is the just steel of the righteous? I ask you, is this the great nation our brothers and sisters gave their lives to save? You who call this living, Dishonor the name of the immortal flames. It is but a slow death. Our enemies surround us. The savage hordes of the Amalja wait beside our roads, strangling the lifelines of trade. Meanwhile, the Garlians make mock of our borders and despoil our land of its natural wealth. We stand on a precipice. Yet we do not act. Whether trader or soldier, monetarist or royalist, all must recognize that a divided Uldar stands to fall. Victory and fortune walk hand in hand. Ye who seek glory and wealth, look not to what little you can snatch from your neighbor but to the boundless wealth of the world beyond. Now is the time to unite. Now is the time to ride forth. In the name of the Sultana, I beseech you. Line not your own coffers, but those of the immortal flames. Seek not to prosper from Uldar, but to restore her to prosperity. As the realm prospers, so shall Uldar, as Uldar prospers. Ya for Uldar! Together we are one. Your grace. Rauba.
<laughs> People of Ulda, I, Nanamo, 17th in the line of all, a drum much has been made. Yet though for the true beloved subjects. Long live Nanamo! Glory to the Sultana! For victory and fortune! There you go. Forsooth! The time is now! I believe! I believe! You. Uh uh, uh uh. Alright, one more to go. Here we go. Final one. The Garleans are another matter altogether. So much for our alliance. It's sunk beyond the seabed. Brothers and sisters of the sea, hearken unto me. Look upon this, our mighty crimson standard, and tell me your hearts do not swell with pride. Seven hundred summers have come and gone since our forefathers first ran aground in this fertile bay. In that time, Guided by the mother of oceans, Limsa Lominsa has grown from humble fishing village to uncontested ruler of the five seas and beyond. Did you look as the Admiral bid you? It is a rather stirring... The Crimson Field is meant to signify the blood of fallen crewmates, when the Galian Empire marched upon all on that day, I these swear are like to their you, recruitment no speeches, basically. Join me. Yeah, I'm going. Uh, although it's the one that I skipped, I'm going Twin Adders. <laughs> okay, return back. You know what? We are by. Right, the ferry. Yeah, I'm just going to take this Arcanist skill. only 80 to go to Vesper Bay. It's pretty good. Hmm. Instead of uh, going all the way over to the other area and then going all the way back, I feel like that was a little bit of a better route.
The gods only know what grand company our adventurer friend will keep. Hm. The wheels of change are in motion regardless. Brother, are you certain this course is best? Whatever do you mean, dear sister? The so-called remembrance ceremonies were little more than standard waving rallies. As though the Calamity and Seventh Umbral Era warranted scarcely a mention. Well, of course they were standard waving rallies. Since you are so observant, mayhap you noticed what mention was made of the Warriors of Light? None. I suppose they must have forgotten the heroes who spared Eorzea a fate worse than the Calamity? No, dear Alizé, they haven't forgotten these details. They have elected to omit them. Deep are the wounds the Calamity inflicted upon Eorzea. So deep, in fact, that the realm still bleeds. Needless to say, the beast tribes and their primals do little to alleviate the pain. So, the task of salving Eorzea's wounds falls to the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, with a little help from our friends, the Grand Companies. One guy is actually wearing a face will mask. Yield no remedy. If our world is to heal, we must put the horrors of the Calamity behind us. Grandfather would never entrust the fate of the realm to despots who rewrite history to their convenience. Whoa. There must be another way to cure what ails this world, and I mean to find it. You are most welcome to try. Our paths may differ, but our destination is the same. In time, I dare say, we will see eye to eye. I should hope so. M -m my lady! We are to escort you! Hope does not come into it. We share the burden of this fate, dear sister, and will prevail together or not at all. The salve will serve not only to close up our present wounds, but prevent old ones from opening anew. <laughs> Alright, so now we choose which one I'm assuming. Join the Maelstrom. This is the flame. Mortal Flames, or what I think we're going to go, which is Twin Adder. Wait, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, cool. Twin Adder it is. Ugly duckling. Head north, uh, or southeast. Oh man.
Wait, where? Ah, shoot. Giant gnats, I hate that. Ah. <laughs> I hate their buzzing. It just some gave me shivers, literally. <laughs> That was a duty.
We should be getting the uh, My Little Chocobo quest soon here. Hopefully. company sorry so you can now or now a member of grand company you've been assigned the rank of private third class your grand company rank can be confirmed if uh time from the profile okay members not in guild but in company seals you can confirm how many seals are currently in your possession under currency in the main menu Quartermaster is stationed at each Grand Company headquarters and will exchange items for company seals, supplies, and provisioning. Each time you uh, cool. Yes, please. Where's our which will be done? Oh, we need to go back to them. Present. Where are they? Oh, right here. Give me seals. Ah. Be issued a. Uh, you must first obtain a serpent chocobo assurance by exchanging how many seals with the quartermaster. Once you have this deed presented to the man. Okay. Quartermaster's right here. So I think I need to do this quest first then. As you get, as a reward, you get 300 seals. Yeah. So let's go here. Yes, yes. Right now, I don't think we really have any at all. And then go over to the Chocobo Keep. Take me over there. Go talk to them. Go back. Go back. And then we should be good to finally have our own mount. At level 30. <laughs> I, I honestly dislike games that make you wait so long to get a mount. I think mounts personally should be available. Maybe not like level one, but like level 10 to 20 in majority of games seems like a reasonable area i mean granted for this game it is technically 20 but it's just like 
to get to level 20 is kind of a it's also locked behind the main story um quest thing it's not just like an ability that you unlock at level 20. kind of wish it just popped like that like at once you hit 20 boom here's a quest you can go do it now and then unlock it but whatever it's the name of the game i guess just unfortunate that's all what did i just drag and drop set aside the formalities we have a favor to ask of you what's that Arianger, have the documents arrived from the students of baldessian aye my lady they arrived but recently no arrived for solution we have conducted a study at the behest of the order of the twin adder papalimo ida a synopsis if you would Our task was to survey the behavior of the Sylphs, a beast tribe indigenous to the Twelveswood. Oh, how to describe them. They look like Gisselgreens, floating ones, that worship the primal Ramu. Ahem. <clears throat> Though technically a beast tribe, Sylphs are blessed with a comparatively personable demeanor, conducive to peaceful communication. Offering us an invaluable opportunity to learn what the beast tribes know of the primals. While Ramu's existence is well documented, the Sylphs do not, or perhaps cannot, summon the primal any longer, insofar as can be ascertained. Until such time as we know, it would be unwise to assume that the threat posed by the primal has passed. Which leaves Gridania with the added worry of not knowing what they should be worrying about. In that regard, they are hardly alone. What we can say with absolute certainty is that Gridania has its hands full fending off Garuda. Who, I need hardly remind you, is among the most savage and terrible of all known primals. In short, it is essential that we approach the Sylphs in as diplomatic a manner as possible. Words and actions can be misconstrued. The only sure way to communicate our intentions is the Echo. Winning the Sylphs' favor may well bring us a step closer to mitigating the threat of the Primals. Will you help us? I am grateful. Lovely. Well, as much Ida Indeed. Leave it. Ah. Uh? Sounds good. All right, now we can go back to this and Serpent Chocobo Insurance. Yeah.
Oh wow, that's actually perfect. I needed to come here anyways. Private play. <laughs> Hi, quartermaster. Got any of them, uh... Hey, the Chocobo insurance. Hey, let me get that. Thank you. Okay. Where's this one at? Oh, it's up there. That's not bad. I'll take my chocobo. I love how they wear the masks. <laughs> ah, thank you. this one oh uh what should i name it Choki? <laughs> i don't know choco bow name I need to use this first. Lancer's Guild? See if I have that one available. I do not. So, let's go grab it. Keep forgetting that you can't travel in the, or you can't use the, um, your mount in the starting area, unfortunately. For the these quest areas. Grab this.
grab this while we're here. Speak with at the Hawthorne Light. Oh. <laughs> I, can, I think they said now you can travel slightly faster. Yeah, now you'll go places slightly faster. level are these? 20? Okay. Still extremely over level. Use the Amber Seraph on the Curious. Is it Curious Tussock? Right there. So once you complete a Realm Reborn, you get uh, flying in all a Realm Reborn areas. Moving to the new expansion areas, you have to collect Aether Currents to unlock. Interesting. Okay. We get to the new expansion areas, I can fly you around to all the currents and unlock it. That's pretty cool. So you need to get specific currents, I guess, which are like the aether. What is it? You collect aether currents to unlock flying.
it really mounts really don't go that much faster to be honest uh yeah before shadowbringers is flying an arr it didn't exist everyone had to ride around on the ground and then they finally added it and nice feature to have I think it's like level 35 or something like that they start helping you in combat which is cool one i remember that i think this is what i did like last your chocobo helps oh okay only the chocobo Healing, fighting, or tanking, all three. Whoa. That's pretty sick. It's like that added boost. Huh. Dude. Just your chocobo. Oh, okay. That's not too bad, though. Still kind of cool that they at least added it. All right. Slay a something. A slay another something. Is that? I guess that's why this person has their chocobo around. Yeah, I can see it fighting. Wait, this person's level 22 and their person is, their chocobo is helping. Oh, maybe they, they probably, <laughs> I don't know. I guess they're using their character or whatever it is. Uh, slay a giant gnat or a gal gnat.
Yo, what's going on, Logan? Yay, thank you for the luck there. Appreciate it. Also, Merry Christmas Eve. <laughs> Got that, and then now we just need so obtain brownie bush brushes. What are they? Oh, are they like the? Oh, are they the plant things? Oh, here it is, brownie brush. Interesting. Here's another one. Also, Merry Christmas. There's the last one. It's easy to miss them, especially with all the text everywhere else. <laughs> Yo, hi, uh, Merry Christmas. Wish you grats. Thank you, I appreciate it. You as well, you as well. Investigate this suspicious present. Level 30, and I've completed the what's that? So, uh, completed the Chocobo Unlock Quest for Grand Company after this travel to um, trap. Once there, there's an NPC that will give you a normal. That's right, not a main story mission. So, level 30. We're almost there then. Over there now. my pet. Do I have to resummon them each time? I wonder. Nah, it doesn't look like it. Search for presents in the or search for clues in the forest. Ah, suspicious box.
Jeez. Uh, if I hit 30 and then I get this, uh, the chocobo, like, companion thing, then after that I'll go knock this out. Uh, cause I haven't done my story quest in, or my, um, uh, not story quest, my, uh, class job quest in a bit now. And I might be missing out on some abilities probably, so. Especially since I'm about to be level 30. And the one I have right now is from like 25. Go here, go there, go there, go here. Go there, speak with this person, come back here. I hope that the the later expansions are a little bit better, like structured for quests. everything else <laughs> but they don't have a way of communicating with each other like over like a hollow net or something like that like a phone sink in effect.
time to go report back. We'll see if this bumps me up to, uh, to 60, or not 60, <laughs> to, uh, 30. Getting there with levels, though. I mean, there's, what, 80 levels? So, we'll see about that, but still. Let's go. Now accept uh, what it said. Mount speed was increased everywhere. <laughs> Damn. Mount speed was increased everywhere. What? Yeah. So, uh. to this here and here be i need to go do something real quick so uh then we'll get to you when i get back all right i am back Was that other one? A pup no longer? What's this one? Whoa. Level 44. Okay. Uh, what's the... Or chocobo, my feisty little chocobo. Uh, assuming you're level 30, you can take the quest My Feisty to get the quest travel to South Shroud and find the Camp Tranquil, which is located in the southern part of the map. Uh did I have that quest there? But then I'm also seeing that there's my feisty little chocobo. Oh, South Shroud.
South Shroud. Oh, Camp Tranquil. There it is. Okay. What's the best way of getting there? East. Um. About central. Okay, we need to go here anyways. So either way, we actually, it kind of works out because we need to go down there. Uh, best route, oh wow. Huh. Actually, seems like we're going pretty fast. So following this road, looks like should take us there just about. I guess I'll just leave it up. South Shroud. Every time I hear that little like jingle right there, it reminds me so much of my time with uh, uh, the one game that I can't remember off the top of my head. Um, Kingdom Hearts. him with water. Wow. All right, cool. Um, let's keep going all the way down. Aha. There it is. Nice. And is there a stone here? There is. It's to the right. Um, is there one down there as well? Yeah, there is. Okay. Well, we might as well get both. Because we're here. So. And look at that. There's a uh, monster right there, too. That's fine. We finally find a monster that's on our hunting list. I haven't seen one in so long. There's another one. Wow. 
We'll, uh, we'll have to get some of them after I attune to this. Coco Bow. Nothing. Mended. We're good. Christmas Eve, my guy. I don't know what platform you're on right now, but there's uh, we're at 75% for the, a boosted stream. Just to let you know. I don't see it. Oh man, it's dumb that it doesn't show up. So that means no community challenge show up or. Um, some people, I mean, it's, uh, maybe it, it expired, maybe? Oh, wait, it was reached. Never mind. What? It never told me. Two hours ago, it reached. What? It sat there for me for, at 75% for the longest time. But I just checked my activity feed and it says two hours ago, 100% complete, promoted 2,800 times. Boost power went up one viewer. <laughs> yeah, what's going on, Yobek? Ah, so this is everyone, everyone's time. I only have like, I have like less than an hour left for tonight, but that's okay. Um, Cause I have a uh, dinner with my girlfriend's family just us <laughs> dude I went to bed early so early last night I literally got in bed at like 10 30 and Yara literally cried every almost every two hours like on the dot she was like anxious at first and then like later on in the night she had to go to the bathroom like so many times poor little baby oh <laughs> we just have to go back here i attuned to this one right yep boom jelly porting nail The touchpad. Oh, really? Huh. How's it going? Right, did you, um, are you on the same server as me and everything? By the way? <laughs> I chose Aether yet. And then what, um, okay. What world did you choose? Did you choose Genova? I mean, you can choose any world. But... Nova is the the one that I'm on. Codes you can use for double XP, I think. Really? Or buy an account. 
believe so. It didn't give me a choice uh a choice because it was full. Huh. Fighting with your chocobo. Oh, okay. Uh, in addition to riding with him, you can also summon your chocobo to fight alongside you. You can do this. Uh, will also require a bunch of greens. This chocobo can be purchased. Summon your chocobo, simply use the greens. The rural chocobos can only fight in the same places in which they can be ridden, so don't expect your faithful steed to follow you in the depths of the dungeon like Camera the Croft or Copper Bell Mines. <sighs> Hey yo, Choco Bo. Do we get another tab for this? Once summoned to battle, they will remi remain for 30 minutes or until he suffers injuries to give you your commands order tab. Priest stance. You can dismiss your companion at any time by selecting withdraw. Use another bunch of greens to summon your steed again. Wait, so do you need to buy them specifically, like a bunch of them, or is it just one one time use? Uh, chocobo saddle bag. No. Oh. Hmm. It's very cluttered sometime. I joined a free company that randomly invited me, but I just sent for the mailing crew. <laughs> There's a companion now. Ah. Gil's appearance. Whoa. You can level them up too? Holy crap. Oh, you need. How do you get these? You need greens in order to get them? Free stance, allow your companion to make its own decisions in battle. Defender, healer, attacker, follow. They level up? What? There's like a cardinal, uh, cardinal direction button, right? It's weird, dude, story time, story time. Oh boy. Wait, so where do I get my... Will he stay mounted if I... Oh, he'll come back to battle. Okay, nice. I named my character Dev Duke, wanted to play as myself, wanted to join again, and she was like, she legit is, is Dev Duke your real name? And I'm like, how did she know? <laughs> That's funny. How do I get up there? What are the odds? Are you crying? The branch there, you found it? Yeah, here we go. I noticed my, uh, my mount speed is a lot faster right here. And then the other area I was just in. Wait, so in order to call in your mount, you need that specific item. They only last for 30 minutes. Oda, how dare you betray me? This is where I got my stone for white mage. Voice can be acquired for new companion specific traits. Oh god. There's a little more east, but it's in this area. 
is like that is there a specific thing you need to do to to become a white mage like that must die to a level 12 tree while looking at a scroll it's part of your ms oh okay cool oh i see Yeah, I am so behind on my story. So like the other day, I decided that I was still gonna level and stuff. Hold on, let me let Kiara up. Come on. Um, I would say the main story quest dev, I think. Yeah. Cause then you can literally just hit that button and it'll equip your best gear that you have. Um, you get a lot of stuff from playing the game anyways. Just like doing quests, so. The one I'm on wants me to have level five armor. So you can either go do other additional quests or you can um, access your saddlebag. Okay. See. What else does he have? So, where do you get the... <laughs> Is it right here? That bro. So <laughs> Step mod. I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to do. Oh, wow. I've had these for a while now and I never use them. What? Uh, you can buy them from most vendors in different areas. Oh, okay. Shop. Maybe if I go to the shop person. Oh wait, Is that this person or no? That's a feather trader. They're insanely cheap. Oh really? Ooh, 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 ooh. Um, pairs maybe? Their repair person will have them. Merchant and mender. Greens you can buy. I have a, quite a few extra I can give to you if you like. Ah, that's, that's fine. Tools. Are they under items? I shall greens. Okay, here they go. I'll buy like 20. Boom. Now what? 40, 50, 60, 80, there, 100. Uh, 
Uh, where do you start as Ar Arcanist, like on the map? Uh, I believe it's uh, Limsa Lominsa. That's where you start. That's where I started, and that's where the uh, the Arcanist Guild is. It's like all the way to the west and the main area. There. All right. I guess we can go hand this in. I don't know what this a pup no longer is. Oh wait. Uh, I might have to. Who's Den's beer? Go here, I guess. He's starting in the mother's crib. I'm assuming post end. I'm assuming going over to this thing. Ah, didn't mean to grab that. Yes, take me over to Wolves Den. Hate how you can't set waypoints? I th thought you could. Unless if I'm just wrong. Test your skill at PvP. Oh god, is this PvP thing? Ah! I haven't seen anything on console S3 company that they said you couldn't. Oh, really? Huh. You know, I just got a, an odd framing for right now. I really want like a Wawa, like, um, ham and cheese sandwich. But I'm literally having dinner in like an hour. I haven't eaten like any actual food today, though. Let's get to this. Grant an entry to the wolves then. Match you against other adventurers like you. If you are interested, speak with Great Park. Okay. Let's go to this. Um, actually, I want to knock this out. So, Elport there. I'm so far behind on my main main scenario quest and. Um, my story, like my class, class. Don't worry about, um, isn't it 4 p.m. in EST? Yes, it is. It's 4.09. Uh, I haven't eaten because I just woke up. It's breakfast time. <laughs> Dude, breakfast is the best thing to have at any time. Three is breakfast, eight is lunch, four a.m. is dinner. <laughs> like, so I'm twenty five. I this. My story or my class quest is 25, but my main scenario quest is 23. It's pretty bad. <laughs> I also need to attune myself to this side because then it would be a lot easier to come here.
duty. Is it? I always forget. Okay, it's companion skills. East Coast, East Coast, yo. <laughs> Give me my quest. Dance before the old wooden box. Oh, of course, why wouldn't you dance before the box? Huh? Yes, I'm shower. Okay. I'm gonna hand in this quest or two. Oh God, it's down below. Okay, well, from my understanding, you don't die. If you jump. We'll go to one HP. Just don't go into combat. I love how fast the, the health regenerates in this game. It's pretty cool. Central Coast, I, uh, Central's cool, I swear. We're in between everyone, so we can chill whenever. <laughs> Oh yeah, you have to dance. Open up. <laughs> ah! Oh god. Oh god, I'm stuck. You left PR out there. Dance for the trading post. Why am I just dancing everyone for everyone? What is that? What is that? Why did they all just come flying down here? <laughs> Two pets, please, and a side of rocks. All right, boys, I need to hand in some of these quests here and then uh, hop off. Let me open the door for Kiara too. I'm stuck. Ah. Pulling thing. Go, go, 
go, go, go. I don't think I have any better gear yet, yeah. Had this slowed out for a while now. Fresh with the tape. Thank you, thank you. I trimmed out my uh my beard a little bit too. I feel like it's a little bit cleaner. Not as like uh crazy looking as it was last. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, before we head there, let me go to this thing. I'm just trying to finish this last quest. Just attune to this thing. <laughs> Rachel better compliment me? Yes, he should. Uh, I'm trying to fire it. Find out how to get up there. How does one get up there? Almost like it's its own, like, area. Things are level 31. Ah! I mean, I am level 30. So I guess it's not the worst. Can you name mounts? Yes, you can. I named mine Oda. I don't know why, but I really like the name Oda from, uh, like, Cyberpunk. I was thinking of that recently. So, and when I made my other character, too, uh, like, before I made this one, to mess around with and just like test out the game again um i named him oda silverhand <laughs> because of cyberpunk it's like haha it's not johnny silverhand it's oda silverhand so cuz hawk <laughs> um all right let's go here Wait, Dev, so what, uh, what class did you, wait, why am I, oh, I'm pressing the wrong ones. What, uh, did you go Archer? Yo, Bex, do you still, do you still play this game too, by the way? Archer, yep, nice. Nope. Oh. <laughs> it's been a while, okay. Did you do like all the the content and everything like all the the story stuff and expansions i'm assuming you haven't done the latest one nah <laughs> just up to level 40 damn and over oh wait this that's what i'm looking forward to most because i've heard so many good things about 
the, the extra stuff. So... That's what I'm actually excited for. I spoke to someone uh, not too long ago, uh, like in the free company that I'm in, and they said that uh, once you hit like a certain, uh, what is it? Once you get done all of the Realm Reborn storyline, which is what I'm doing right now, uh, once you finish that, then you can fly around all the areas other than like the main areas and then after you do that then you can um we're we going to arcanist skill then you can do the new storylines and also unlock buying by doing uh other quests there but i know i am i'm literally i know because not pick this up. And um oof. Oof. Ah uh, Okay, that's actually not too bad. Just like two areas we need to get through. In order to get there uh da, 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 da. oh but i've heard like the new the stories are like really good